Hi everyone, welcome to the Zachary Experience. We will be trying out Scarlet Nexus today. I'm actually super excited about this, so just give me a few minutes and we'll begin shortly. Okay, I'm so excited for this. So again, if you're just tuning in, um, you are here with the Zachariah Experience, and we are playing Scarlet Nexus. I'm super excited about this demo. I'm super excited about this game. I've seen things about it here and there. Um, seen glimpses of gameplay. I didn't really want to spoil too much for myself. And I know that um, the demo came out last week for Xbox and this week for PlayStation. So I thought, let's add it to the list. Let's give it a try. Downloaded it this morning. Um, and I'm excited. It looks like a really cool game. I'm seeing a lot of great feedback. I tried to avoid watching too many of the videos because I wanted to, you know, experience it with you all as opposed to just uh, watching it um, and kind of spoiling some of it, uh, some of the experience. So again, just like how we did with Resident Evil, we're just going in blind. So we're going to see how this works. So I'm really excited. So I know we have to pick a story who we're going to pick. Let's pick, we'll pick him first. Oh, we'll read both. Yu Yuito Sumeragi. He comes from a great family who are descendants of the Founding Father. Cheerful and optimistic, he's a young boy with an unwavering and kind heart. Having had his life saved by the OSF when he was young, he was inspired to join the OSF as a volunteer to be able to save others. He fights close quarters with a combination of quicksword attacks and psychokinesis abilities. Okay, and what does her story say? Let's read hers. Kasane Randall. Uh, scouted by the OSF, she was an elite cadet at the academy, always at the top of her class. Cool, rational, and indifferent to others, the only person she's opened up to is her adoptive sister. She's extremely loyal to her and will do anything for her sister. She fights at range with a com combination of ranged multi-blade attacks and psychokinesis abilities. So remember there was like, I was seeing some discourse online about how there's kind of like an X-Men kind of thing going on here, so... Um, 
interested to see how that looks and how that plays. Mysterious organisms that fall from the sky who, or they're called others, who feed on human brains. Oh my gosh, they're ecology. Okay, well, I tried y'all. Okay, so we just thrown up in there. Okay, move with, uh, and reset camera. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh, this is pretty. It was giving like apocalypse kind of vibes. Okay. Move. This is the final trial. I have to be ready. Okay. Stop thinking so much. I have to focus on what's in front of me. If I can complete this once. assignment, I'll be a member of the OSF. Soon, I'll be able to make my childhood dreams come true. Kind of reminds me a little bit of Fantasy Star Universe. For those who play that game. That's one of my favorite games. I know some people don't like it and it kind of has mixed reviews, but I don't know what it was about that game playing it as a kid. I played some of the PSP ones. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, so I can start throwing things. Okay, let's see. I want to kind of slash, though. Lock onto an enemy with R3, press against disengage, lock onto enemies a basic tactic, apply in fighting because it's easier to hit is it easier to hit your target, lock on as soon as you encounter an enemy. Okay, good to know. Come on. Here we go. We did hold it, okay. Come on. All right. Take the card? No, I didn't think so. Haha. <laughs> I kinda wish I had a double jump. 80, what does that mean? Uh, Yuto fights using his power psychokinesis and with his sword. The attack range of his sword is short, but he can overwhelm enemies with his fast attack. He attacks enemies one by one at a close range. This woman attacks with square, slightly charges the psychokinesis gauge. Use a mix of weapon and psychokinesis to dis dispatch enemies. Hitting an enemy with a weapon attack will automatically lock you onto that enemy. Automatic lock on and targets which can be changed. Okay, what? Hitting an enemy with a weapon attack? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, that's cool. I got nothing to throw here. Oh, so I guess they're waiting for me. Okay. Let's kick that. Okay, move. Circle step. Okay, so we're gonna move because he's gonna touch me. Oh, so it kind of closes the battlefield, right? Because it seems like I was stuck in there for a minute. Okay, cool. Ooh, this is kind of like. Kind of sensitive. Okay. There's a chance she would know something about her. A lock on what? Through this exam, no matter what. R plus what? Oh, so I just hold it, and then I can switch. Okay. Wait, did I not do it? Oh, X was oops, 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 sorry, sorry. But I do that. Defeat an enemy with a rising slash. Is that not it? Okay. Oh. oh. Oops. <laughs> I'm like, wait, I'm in the air. There we go. Take that. Okay, that's kind of cute. All right. This is, this is definitely different than what I expected. Okay. Love the graphics though. It's really pretty. Oh, I can just dance dangerous. around. I like that. Take that. Here we go. Let's keep this up. Oh, I'm out. Okay, okay. Oops. You missed. So you gotta use both to keep it up. Interesting, okay. You can just throw things around if you want. Press triangle while moving to perform a swooping, moving spin attack in a wide area. The psychokinesis gauge will cover greatly, so adding this to combos allows you to fight while sustaining the gauge. You can only use once per combo. Okay. So how do I do that? Oh! Weapon attack when landing. Okay, press square.
sorry, I'm actually getting I'm trying to get used to this. Get up. I'm just saying, is that right? Here we go. Oh, that's the rush attack. Okay, okay, okay. When a square or triangle attack lands, performing a psycho needs to attack with holding a chosen zone, a power stick, and a follow up attack. Okay. Okay. So. Oh, I kind of like that. Oh, no. That's right. Give me a sec. Nice. I like that. Kind of reminds me of ma like the way it looks. Kind of reminds me of magic, like a magic attack after like a physical attack. Um, take that. <laughs> it's like ah. Eh. Oh, nice, nice. Okay, okay, okay. That's pretty cool. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna be kinda like, especially when there's a lot of enemies, that'll be useful. I do everything I learned from my training. I should be able to win. I have to. Oh, who are you? Hello. Take that. To look at it later because there's a lot of moves going on. This concludes the aptitude test. Oh, I like that. That was kind of cool. It's like a nice little jump around, kind of, you know, use the environment but also have your weapon. Dealing with status ailments. The plug in equipment offers resistance against various status elements. It is recommended you change your equipment to match the enemy you face. So I'm assuming it's going to be you use either either of the characters we've seen, but there may, I'm assuming, maybe other allies. I think I saw, like, a, a video where he had, like, two allies, I believe. I don't remember if they were doing that much, but... Oh, look at this. Kikuchiba, Deserted Merchant City. Oh, yeah, I feel like this is what I remember. So now I got two allies, Hanabi and Gemma. Again, y'all, y'all know how I feel about the mini font. Like, kind of sure introduce them. So this is kind of what I saw in the gameplay video. So I wonder if that's what we're gonna be playing through now. Oh, ooh, oh, look at that hologram caution tape. It's kind of interesting. So we're all here. Seto. Captain Narukami, may I ask a question? No. You don't have to be so formal. We call each other by our first names in the OSF so we can strengthen our bonds. Most of us don't look our age. Ranks are there just to calculate pay. The OSF only values strength. Remember that. That's the gist of it. So what was your question? Right. Um... Wataru... isn't here yet. Wataru is this platoon's operator. He'll direct us from headquarters. My power allows me to communicate telepathically without the system's assistance, up to around 500 kilometers. That being said, it's a lot of work, so join the group. Open your personal port. Hello. Team leaders will be Nagi, Yuito, and Sugumi. Each of you, listen to Wataru's orders and move to the designated goal. Try to take down any others along the way. Retreat is allowed if you think you can't handle it, but reach your goal. That's all. Understood. Okay. See you later. Good luck. Received a brain message? Leave support to me. Uh... 
Okay, so it looks like there's like something. There's like different calls. So it's like a group chat. I normally watch the entire platoon statuses at the same time. Leave your physical and mental status to me. I'll let you know when your health is low, so don't keep fighting when I do. Also, I use telepath telep telepathy for anyone who goes to a place with bad reception. Telepathy is a direct connection to me, so be aware of that. Everyone's life is in my hands. Maybe that's overstating it, but that's so serious. I'll take it. I look forward to working with you. Hey, well, please take it seriously, because, I mean, we're out in the field fighting for our lives. Okay. Um, this looks neat. The teams are split up, but you can use brain talk to share information. We should use Hanabi's power. It sprayed something like oil. Don't get oh. on you. Did not even notice that. Oh, wait, what just happened? SA SAS is a brain-to-brain -brain connection with virtual cable that allows you to temporarily use allies' powers. SAS menu is displayed in the lower right of the screen during battle. Press R1 plus any of those buttons will activate the SAS entered into each slot. Oh, okay, I like that. Each power's effect lasts for a limited time. When the gauge reaches zero, the effect will stop. You can stop the effect yourself with either R1 plus R3 or R1 plus one of the, whatever button it was. Each power recovers at a different rate, but once it does, you can use it again. Oh, that's kind of neat. Okay. By borrowing pyrokinesis, flames engulf weapons and PK objects for the attack, and weapon combos will have an increased area. It increases damage to the enemy and can also cause burn status when repeatedly used. It is effective against enemies with oiled status. Right, that makes sense. Additional effects we add as you strengthen your bond with an obby. Oh, kind of neat. Okay. Why don't we attack it with pyrokinesis? Use SAS. Okay, yeah, which one are you? And look out. See, this is this can be that. Okay. Connecting to SAS hurts until here, but it really feels like you're fighting together. Reminds me of uh, Tales of Hysteria. It'll work. Oh, yes, I got a double jump now. Awesome. I was I was wondering if we were going to get one, because I was like, even in the tutorial, I was like, uh... Okay, he's running, like, super fast. I think you can... So we can run a little slow. I'm trying to look around. Oh, so we're in battle. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, take this. L2, what is that? Mean? Oh. Nice! Nice! Should we try somebody else's ability? Let's try this. Sure. Ooh, what are you doing? Oh! Time. Pyrokinesis will work on that one. Ah, uh, okay. Definitely. Oh, I like your little. Now this reminded me of. Oh, what's that game? Uh, is it the Metal Gear? I need your help. Oh, and then we can let them have the finisher sometimes. Okay, I like that. Sure. that Ooh, so flashy. What does he have on his back, though? What is all this? What is with the... Is that part of his... Can just jump down there? Oh, didn't let me go down there. Oh, press R. Oh, yeah, yeah. Heal up, guys, because I'm going to need you to... I need y'all to be utilized hmm. soon. Okay, is that healing? The resource reading is close. Should we get it? Is that this way? I mean, let's look around while we're here. Don't wander off. Don't go into heavily damaged areas. Okay, but now we are, so. Understood. I'm good at reading the air. I mean, my power is aerokinesis after all. Okay, just use this. Let's is this Earth? That awkward pause was in my power too. <laughs> right, like, girl. Nobody cares. I don't even know these characters, let me know it. Nice. Uh, let's. Did I turn it off? Yeah, just heal up. Oh, okay. I hope we kind of like. Okay, ooh, am I stuck? Okay. Um. Guess he just goes so fast. Just jumping around, bobbing around. Very interesting. I like, you know, I really like these kind of post-apocalyptic kind of looking 
spaces. I, I like games with that. I just, I'm not saying it's cool, because I mean, obviously we're going through like a pandemic right now, and like that's not really the move or the look, but in just video games, I like, I like that idea. Like I see they have like a little more technology behind them and they're able to kind of do a little bit more, but I, I like this kind of stuff. I like how it looks and like, I like how it feels. So let's, um, and the, the way this game is done, I mean, it's beautiful. I have to water the flowers at headquarters. <laughs> oh, I have to water my plant too, sis. The seeds we planted in those pots have sprouted. Oh, thank you. Hold down L2 to consume the PG and attack with special objects after hitting the enemy and put the follow up. Oh, wow. So many different ways to fight. Okay, let's try nice that. Recovery. I know, right? Uh, let's Every household should have a dependable combo. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I think I messed it up. Okay, we're gonna show that again. Oh, there we go. I had to hold it. Oops, my bad. Oh, oh. Wow. I... Yeah. Yeah. One day. I have no idea you could use it like that. Your power is really great. Thank you. You all right? We'll see. Oh, who are they fighting? I'm just like, oh, let's look around. Imagine if the boss is like, kind of difficult because you gotta get close with you and run out of like, Kinesis ability. Okay, then more of that. Oh, I, I'm liking this. This is fun. It's like a flashy, fun. Um. Oop. Let me borrow this. Can I have some of this, please? Put them up. Gotta forget. I forget. Uh huh. Do that. Attack him. There we go. Yeah. Okay, sure. So can we only use these these two characters, and then everyone else is basically support, and then we just kind of get to. Oh, so that's little items, okay. Yeah, I mean, I guess I get an X-Men vibe from it. Oh, we have a new parking garage, so. Bunny ear mask. the objective. Oh, maybe it's supposed to go upstairs, my bad. My bad. Wow, look at this. Wow. It's such an interesting looking game and such an interesting looking environment. Like, this is not a game I would have usually just said, hey, let's play. So I'm actually really glad they did the demo because I'm, like, really enjoying this. It reminds me of, like, a couple of games I've played in, like, different ways. Um... It gives it gives the world ends with you kind of vibes. I like that. Oh, who wants war? Focus. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. Activating brain drive comes with many additional effects, such as increased attack power, reduced psychokinesis gauge consumption, and reduced lifting time for psychokinesis objects, allowing for a more expeditious fight. The brain drive gauge will be displayed while it is active, and after a certain amount of time, it will automatically deactivate. When outside of battle, the brain drive gauge will deplete more slowly. Cool. Cool, cool. Keep oh! Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Oh, y'all see that? Oh, I like that. Who else wants some? Who is this one? Oh, got it. Oh my gosh. Leave it to me. Take that. So do we get something extra for doing that? I wasn't expecting oil. Hey! 
I should remember to hold it after. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay, Neji. looking around because it's such a cool environment. Okay, let's go. What is this? Oh, so many like signs and little visuals. Like it's really just a really beautiful game. Okay, we're gonna go this way. And I like the music too. I just can't really hear it. I don't know what's up with um, the headphones and music. Like they're not too loud. I turned up the volume from last time, but oh wow. This place is incredible. The city is above and below us. It feels like I'm in a VR from a theme park I went to when I was a kid. Uh, meta. It used to serve as the connection base to Togetsu. The city infrastructure was destroyed in an other attack about five years ago. So, what you see is what remains. Togetsu is the stronghold of the Togetsu faith, right? It's kind of like a cult. Don't say that out loud. Kagura was a believer. He was even a priest at one time. Uh. What? That guy is a priest? Hey, you do realize I can hear you, right? <laughs> right? Our platoon's headsets are all connected. I was gonna say, just don't, just stop, just stop talking. No, don't worry about it. My parents were believers, so I just naturally became a priest. I don't care about the teachings at all. Now that Kikuchiba is like this, you hardly ever see people coming to Suo from the church anymore. Uh oh. What's that drone doing? Damn, they found us even though we were jamming them. Crows, Captain. So they sniffed us out. Look alive, everyone. Crows? And the press. Guys, the crows will make a big deal out of this. Let's make it exciting. The city vision projectors must be broken. They're pretty. Goop Brain Talk is a very convenient system that only OSF members can use. Normally, it provides lagless communication, but if you're separated by too great a distance, you lose the ability to communicate altogether. Oh, sorry. Uh, so be careful. Um, oh, one other thing: you guys are connected locally, but I'm connected via Signet. That means if there's a problem with Signet, I won't be able to communicate with you. Make sure you give detailed battle reports so that I can handle any situation you might be thrust into. Don't worry, though. I'll make sure to do my job in supporting you. Oh, you know, I kind of thought he would be kind of chill more, but he's actually, like, really cool and kind of supportive. Um, okay, what is going on here? I know I said not to worry about what other people think, but in reality, there are rude people who discriminate against those who were not scouted. Don't listen to that drivel. Uh, because they were specifically chosen after the National Health Test and Power System, they think scouted troops are the elite of the OSF. People who say things like that are a dime a dozen. That's right. Um, that doesn't change the fact that there are people with incredible powers in both the volunteer and adult factions. There's no need to ever put yourself on a lower rung. Yep, got it. Thanks, Commander. I'll take all that to heart. Well, because I wasn't given growth-scenting hormones until this age, we have the capable, charming man you see here. It's not all bad, you know. Wow, so there really are guys who call themselves charming. I've never seen one in the wild. <laughs> You're electrifying even through brain messages, Sugumi. You're giving me pins and needles. Captain Seto, thank you so much. I won't lose to someone like that. Yui Toast, anyone says something terrible like that to you and your crew, just let me know. I'll give them an earful. Oh, I kind of like their team dynamic. It seems pretty nice. Yeah. It's like they're looting. Oh, here they come. Wow, just oh I really I really like the art design in this game. It's really pretty. Kinda different. I haven't played a game that looks like this in a while. The only one it's reminding me of is that Metal Gear game. It really reminds me of that. Upper level construction site. So, yeah, sure, let's go. This is cute, y'all. I like this. What does a Togetsu priest do? Oh, are you interested in me? Please. No, not at all. Uh. I'm just a best 
She's like, uh, no. <laughs> That's what I would have said. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have even asked, though, to be honest. Don't really want to know. So I hope y'all have been having or having a great week um, going into the weekend. It's been kind of a busy, chaotic week for me. So I was really looking forward to doing this. I kind of wanted to be a little bit of a surprise stream. Because I knew it was coming, and I was like, let's see, because you know, we've been playing Resident Evil for a while, and I've been enjoying that, but I definitely wanted to give y'all something a little different. And I, I did get some games with the recent days of PSN sales, so we're going to be playing those. Starting next week, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to do it, because I still want to keep going with Resident Evil. I think we might lengthen the streams that we've been doing, only because... Well, first of all, I was, like, dying to get off after our last stream. Uh, I was losing my mind. <laughs> um, but I do want to increase uh, how long we go on stream, just because... I want to get through the game at like a certain pace and um for those watching and following i want to make sure we get through it as soon as we can excuse me by borrowing sclerokinesis harden your entire body and render enemy attacks ineffective Ooh, the effective time shortens with the number of enemy attacks use it when there are no means to escape the enemy's attack oh additional effects will be added as you strengthen your bond with gamma oh i like that so he's kind of like the i knew he was like earth but i just thought earth attack Ooh. should be effective against that to, did that help? I don't think I'll do it in time. Protect me. I'm gonna stay away from this one. He's he a hardhead. Oh. Do you need help? Catch me now, catch me now. Ooh, now you see me, now you don't. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I like that. Oh, and he can run up. What is he doing? No, 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 no. Look alive, look alive. Kinda wish why do I wish circle was jump? What game did I play? Move, remove, move. Oh my god, that hurts. Oh no. Did you get up. Here we go. Snap out of it. Thanks. Sorry for the trouble. Oh, is that a bad look? Sorry, my bad. I should use the item. Okay. Come on. Protect me, please. So I wonder, is the other girl gonna have totally different allies? Or is she gonna have the same kind of situation? And I don't have a guard button, yet, I don't think. Oh, oh! You know it. Definitely gonna do it. I'm gonna do more than that. Help me out, sis. Burn him up. Come on. Got it. Ooh, yes, yes, get him, get it again. <laughs> yes. Oh, I liked that. Oh, I'm enjoying this. This is cute. I love how there's all these different ways you can kind of say, okay, I'm gonna mess you up. But, but they kind of messed me up too, so how do I... Okay, I can use these. So I'm going to use that next time, because I don't want to die again. And I wonder, is it because of the demo that they got me back up, or... Is that just how it goes? Yeah, I got it. Good. Nice. Oh, like even the battle music. What does it remind me of? 
Um, can't think of the game right now. Oh, and then I can go through walls. Oh, circle steps become teleportation moves, allowing you to attack dangerous close range enemies with quick strikes before retreating to a safe distance, additionally performing a weapon attack while in the range of a target teleports you next to the enemy. Yeah, we saw that for a slash attack. It also allows you to move through walls. Oh, okay, Luca. Luca, you might be my favorite. We'll be able to move forward if we use my power, Yuito. Oh, I don't know if people really know, but I, I like, if, if I had a superpower, I would want it to be teleportation. One, because I would save money on teleporting. Um, and I mean, transportation, like I would just be able to you know, be where I need to be. But also because I just think that's like a super cool. Thing. Like I've literally had, I've literally had dreams, like and I actually do remember them, where I've like tried to teleport in my dreams. Like I've been like, please, it didn't work. But I mean, it was like, it was, it was a desire. <laughs> but um, you know, teleportations, like I would, mean, I think would be cool too. But I don't want to say it, but the other way. Makes those things flare up on my back. So it's, that's that Septentrion or whatever he was saying. Um, I'm assuming. Oh, well, I guess that's a no. Move, move, move. Yep. Thank you. Uh, let's go with you first. Oh, I didn't like that. Leave it to me. Okay, no, you, we gotta do a you again. Uh, sure, for now. Go, Yuito. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I tried to use my item, it didn't work. Sorry, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry for the trouble. How okay, can we find out how to use the item right now? Okay, so that is how you use it, so I don't understand. You should be able to break the outer shell and keep attacking. Shell is broken. Oh, she's back. Let's go. Let's go dark side. Everything you have. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god, not this again. Thank you. Okay, so that's the second time I've died. I wonder if that affects my score. But I gotta start, I, I gotta recognize that there's like a moment that the healing takes. So I haven't, what does that say? Clairvoyant. So we don't know what her, we haven't really got a tutorial on her power. Hopefully her power has some healing aspects, because I could use those. What did I use? I used the oh, I used the all light jelly. Oh, okay. Oh no. 
By borrowing, here we go. By borrowing the clairvoyance power, you can detect invisible enemies and see through poor visibility conditions such as fog. Additionally, perfect dodges are easier to execute, allowing you to trigger a powerful read attack by performing a weapon attack immediately after. Awesome. Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your bond with Skumi. Okay. Uh, okay, let's get back. Oh. Where are you going? Oh, that's why everything slowed down. When I, I thought it was. I thought she had like a time attack. Okay. Now we kind of have an idea of everyone's abilities, which is pretty awesome. Oh wait, no. <laughs> uh, I I didn't want to come over here just now. Since I was a cadet, but it still makes me uneasy sometimes. I worry that someone might hear everything I'm thinking. Yeah, that think. won't happen. It's not telepathy. But so I what are they hearing? Don't worry. Huh. Go back down. I just want to see, make sure I didn't miss anything. Continue. Yeah, I'm excited to see how many different, you know, allies you can get and kind of what their abilities will be. Hi. Help me out. I know they kind of have to work together because they need to be able to... We'll see. Um, I like how they have to, they all kind of get the power, so they all have to work together to eliminate the enemy. Okay, they were in here? Okay, let's go. Wish there was a way to run faster. I don't think so yet. This one, we're in battle. Okay. Super cool. Yeah, I'm liking this. This is fun. I want to see what the story would be, like if it had a really cool, engaging story, um, you know, akin to like, you know, Final Fantasy or Tales of with some plot twists and stuff, I could really see myself, you know, getting this game. This is, oh gosh. I just want to press R2 instead of R1. Oops, ouch. That hurts. Nice. Oh, 
Did you, is there a bonus you get from doing the, the deaths or no? Yes, thank you. <laughs> Needed that. Thank you. Oh, okay. Yes, thank you. Needed. So needed. Very cool. I mean, wow. Just wow. Oh, Yuito's team is the first to the objective. Nice going. Yeah. Hey. Uh oh. Do you hear something? Good instincts, Yuito. I'm getting other readings nearby. No. Wait. This is a major other. Captain, Sugumi, a major other has appeared at the objective. Surprise, surprise. Major others are others that have killed OSF members in the past. Captain! It'll take a few minutes for the rest of the teams to arrive. This may be rough for rookies, but hold out. Bring it on. Uh, oh my gosh. I guess we've got no choice. Hanabi, let's go! Alright, I'm ready. Is Gemma not here? <laughs> this thing does look pretty tough. Yeah, we have to have a plan of it. Oh, look up there. There's some material. Focus. Oh, perfect timing. Oh, look. Yeah. Yuto, use your psychokinesis to slam it down on his head. Okay, got it. Oh, okay. Keep your eyes open. 
You especially, Yuito. Your power lets you use the things around you. Don't focus only on the enemy in front of you. Yes, sir. Go, Yuito. Keep up with that. We do it? Not yet. Are you okay? All of you, stay back or you'll get hurt. So the hero of this fight is, of course, Private Yuito Sumeraki, who took down a major other on his first assignment. It's giving Persona vibes, Congratulations, too. Congratulations, Private Sumeraki. Actually, Let's quite a bit of Persona vibes. Thanks. How do you feel? Uh, I'm glad we were able to defeat the other. Your first victory on your first deployment. Was it satisfying? Um... Uh, I can't answer you very well myself. Please, ask the commander. Yuito, where is the media training? Septentry on 7th class, Captain Sato How did Private Sumeragi do? Both Yuito and Hanabi fought very well. The fact that Private Sumeragi was put under your command, Captain, must mean that the top brass thinks highly of you. Well, what's so weird That's about Yuito? I don't to ask remember. my superiors about. We're pulling out. The mission doesn't end until we get to Suo. Keep your eyes open. Understood. <laughs> Yo, 
Yeah, I wonder what this game, like, I kind of want to know the story. It's giving me, also, Final Fantasy Type-0, zero, Type zero, very much, but I didn't play that game a lot, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, what is going on? And it's also reminding me of Devil Survivor. If anyone's played those games. There's a lot going on. I think that's the only thing I need for this to like tie it together and make me feel I need it is if um I don't know if there's some really deep there needs to be some twists and turns, I need some defecting from the OSF, I need all that. I need some mess, I need some drama. <laughs> So now we're going to play... Can I get a special item for the full game? The item you get depends on your progression in the demo, so please keep your demo data. Cool, cool. So now we're going to play through... the second story demo. I think Kas Kasane, if that's what I'm saying her name right, I feel like she's going to be very different, so this should be interesting. I kind of wish I could, um, maybe I should have done that while we were there, but I, I'll, next time I play this, I'll definitely make the, um, the audio for the music a little higher because I'm actually really enjoying it. Can I change it right now actually? Okay. Can we do all that? Let's um here we go. Like I don't hear like a dramatic difference, but okay. There we go. Okay. So that's your sister, I'm assuming. I have to focus. I should be able to complete the assignment as long as I'm calm. Okay, let me update. Sorry. I'm gonna make their voices a little louder, too. Oh, did I not save it? My bad. Understood. Okay. Okay. Okay, that double jump could could be pretty useful right about now. Okay. 
I can annihilate the other with my psychokinesis. Naomi even complimented me on how well it was suited for combat. Yeah, now I kind of look like this into the so I should be able to. It's done. Ooh. Okay, I like that. So she kind of pulls them in, okay. Oh, I like that. Nice. Formal forward step, okay, yeah. Don't get this wrong this time. I wonder if Naomi is doing okay. I'm sure she is. She's one of the best. Next. Should we kick? Oh, cool. Bye. It seems like the exam has entered the final stage. I feel like I'm in good form, but I can't relax just yet. Next. It's done. I like her. I find her kind of smooth. I'm not saying he wasn't, but she. I like there's like a smoothness to her moves. Oh, using triangle, you can't do it a backstep work. It's not. It makes a little to tackle something back to a suitable distance. Ooh, the psycho can use this gauge will recover greatly, so adding this to combos of action effect was sustaining the gauge. It can only be used once per combo. So hers is a little bit different. His is kind of like a little. A little, uh. Uh. Throw the sword, kind of attack a little. Um, I'm trying to think of the Kingdom Hearts thing. I don't know. I can't think of it. And then I can jump back by landing a. Distance. Oh, perform a weapon attack with square when landing is like a Phoenix's attack. Hold to close the distance and enemy with the rush fire. Yeah. Okay. So. I like that, just a little buffer, just get me back. Try again in a second. It's done. Next. Yep, that's the movement. I, I, I really like this move, little combo into the... There we go, nice. Next. Learning the rush follow-up attack and cycle can use follow-up attack skills to increase the amount of times. It can be used consecutively, chaining together a rush follow-up attack, a psychokinesis follow-up attack, and then another rush follow-up attack in succession allows you to do heavy damage. Okay, so it's kind of about the back and forth, the no dance of it. I, I just need to apply everything I've learned from my training. I can win.
Fogo Cool, ó. She can have a similar mission, or she can have a totally different mission. Mizuhagawa view from the high ground. You can look across the entire development district from a certain high ground point found in the construction district. It's the best way to watch the sun best place to watch the sunset, so be sure to check it out if you ever need to pause and reflect. I like that. Back step attack as we've seen before using triangle. So I wonder if she's gonna have different allies, different experience. We'll see. Looks like it. So I guess these are two stories, so I wonder if they'll let you in the real game you go back and forth, or you can play through one and then play through the other. Everyone's here. Kyoka. Major Eden, may I ask oh, a that's question? Naomi. Oh, Naomi. We call each other by our first names in the OSF. Don't be so formal. No one looks their age here. And our ranks? They're just words on paper. The OSF only recognizes strength. Okay, what is going on here? What is this alternate dimension? I don't dimension? like to say we judge on strength alone, but that's mostly how it is. So. What was your question? Is this just for the demo? Or is this actual story? Right. That's interesting. Haruka isn't here yet. I wonder if something happened. Haruka is our platoon's operator. She directs us from the back with telepathy. Can you hear me? I'm able to communicate telepathically within a 500 kilometer radius without the system's assistance. It's draining though, so I need you to join the group. Naomi, Kasane, open your personal ports. The team leaders are Naomi and... Oh, Kasane. That's awfully nice of you, Shiden, letting the new scout be leader. <laughs> no, I... I thought it would be best this way, so I volunteered. Okay, okay, let him know. Huh? Well, well. <laughs> it's big of you to go along with that, Shiden. <sighs> <laughs> He's pressed. Okay, let's get this mission on the road. Follow Haruka's navigation to the specified goal. Take out any and all others you see along the way. If you decide not to fight, I authorize you to retreat. That's all. Copy that. Okay, be careful. Don't provoke Sheedan too much. But Gemma's here. Okay. So now we have Arashi and Sheedan. So different party this time. Interesting. I'm kind of confused as to why that is. Why is there like almost like an alternate reality here where she kind of has the same can experience? Can everyone hear me? Lens. We can use brain talk to communicate whenever we want, even while oh, we're split up. Let's well. Let's look. Oh, taking anti-aging drugs, huh? You're all official members of the OSF and have your assigned divisions now. So let me give you a refresher on the anti-aging drug. Powers become unstable and deteriorate with age and growth. That's why we need to stop your growth so you can fight the others over the coming years. That's what the anti-aging drug is for. Well, you've been taking it since you were scouted, so you already know this. Yes, I was given an explanation when I was scouted. I understand it's been added to my daily meals. It's hard to really get a sense of it since it's not as if I feel anything happening to me. But thank you for reminding me about it, Commander Kiyoka. Okay. Let me know if anything happens. It's not lost on me that the more female group's first conversation is about anti-aging drugs. That's interesting. <laughs> the new urban development ward? What a boring assignment. It doesn't matter if a mission is boring or not. You're such an idiot. No <laughs> real others come out here. It's the perfect place to train cadets. When your power gets as strong as mine... Okay, but you're here too. And see, now they have a similar situation happening. The press is coming. What's that drone? Oh man, they found us even though we were jamming them. Major Kyoka, crows. What? I didn't know we had any crow bait with us. Crows? Do you mean the press? They're probably after little Miss Randall. She's a hero that saves civilians. No. Kodama Platoon is in the restricted area farther in. They're probably here for Arashi. Oh, Arashi. Poor Arashi. Always surrounded by crows. <laughs> Finally got out of Kodama Platoon, but I still end up fighting along with them? 
Listen up, everyone. I know the crows will be in your way, but try not to get distracted. Hey. Don't those crows realize that we jam them because we don't want them around? There's nothing we can do. The press uses their right to broadcast OSF activity to do whatever they want. It's depressing, but it's the price we pay for being famous. I confirmed a water attack. Are you okay? Being wet makes it hard to move. Next. I thought there was any chat. I just want to check. Do you understand how to use Brain Talk group? Uh, Brain Talk is a very convenient system that only OSF members can use. What do you think? Are you getting used to it? Naomi, yes, thank you, Ruka. It lets you talk without any lag. Um, yes, that's fundamentally true. Just keep in mind that you won't be able to connect a call if there's too much distance between you. One more thing. We're connected locally, but how Ruka is connected via Cyanet. That means if there's a problem with Cyanet, we won't be able to communicate. Um, staying in contact regularly can save your life, so be sure to use it. Don't worry, I'm here to support you. Understood. Thank you. So you see the conversation's like very similar, but like not exactly similar, so it's not exactly the same. So that's kind of interesting, but... Oh, now we got the brainwaves again. Let's do it. Okay, it looks like we have different ones. Or are they going to be the same in just different color? Oh, but we're... By borrowing electrokinesis. Oh, the attacks and psychokinesis objects will have electricity. It can inflict shock status when repeatedly used. It is effective against enemies with soaked status. Additionally, weapon combos create sparks, making it easier to damage airborne enemies. Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your bone with shooting. So I wonder if there's going to be like a... Use social link aspect to this. Ooh. Did you just block me? Thank you. I'll so let's try you. it. I'm allowing you so to now you support me? SAS. Do your best with it, if you can. I'm so arrogant. Okay. Enemy is done. <laughs> it was thanks to my power. You don't calm down. Take like that. Go for some Ooh, can she? Let's see it. Okay, so we have one similar to Yuito, just using her weapons instead. Very cool. Let's try this instead. I see. So that's how you use your psychokinesis to fight. Seems like a reasonably useful power. Really the extinction belt is thick over Mizuhogawa. During construction, and now a lot of others appear there. There aren't many powerful others, but everyone should still be careful. Take that. No way. Keep up. Next, the enemy is stunned. Now's the time. Show me what you got. I like her little back and forth machine. Go, I'll do it. I've done it twice. Sonic. Ooh, I've done that. Are you, you hurt? Shouldn't be. Conor. Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. Yeah, this is so weird. Oh, I like that. Let's try that again. Get that man. Be on guard. I think that's the way to go, so let's look around here first. Yeah, so I'm kind of confused as how there's like the same characters, but there's different characters, but they're saying the same thing. I'm There's wondering if this is just for the demo, like, Check so they out. don't spoil the actual game. I'm really liking this. This is like a neat game. Hang on, that's the wrong way. Check oh, the objective yeah. point again. I know, I know. I, I can't just explore for a little bit. I wonder if they just made similar stories for the demo, just so... You don't get spoiled too much, I'm assuming, but I'm not sure. I, again, I, I'm playing this kind of blind, because I wanted to do it that way. Um, so I don't really know too much about the story or, you know, the conception of the demo, or kind of what the kind of, I guess, goal was of just having the demo at all. So, um, uh, specifically for this game, I mean, like, um, 
that they just want to show off gameplay. Would be yeah. So this time we have Kagero, we can actually like see him. He's in the party this time. Normal human speed can't keep up with that other. Use SAS. Which one do I use? Oh, her. While borrowing hyper velocity, you can move at a pace that makes it feel as if time slowed down. Oh, I was hoping we get something like this. Use it when confronting fast enemies or those you want to finish off quickly. Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your run with Arashi. So she. Kasane, I think my hyper velocity will be effective. Good to know. Very cool. Finish it. Settle down. <laughs> Got it. Nice. It's up to you. Are you nervous, Naomi? Your breathing is getting a little shallow. Oh, yes, a little. No way. But I'm okay. Just take deep breaths. You're worried about Kasane, She's aren't waiting you? For this to... She was worried about you, too. You must be close. Kasane, go! Gotta check me. It's done. Oh, not her sending it into the void. Okay, sis. Just exploring. The music is so persona. Wish it was like it's loud. It's still not that loud in my ear. <laughs> Look how Arashi is running. Girl, lift your arms up. She's just kind of like dragging them along. Goodies. There's just items all over the place. We're on a construction site, so I mean. I love a little bit of jazz with my hack and slash. What items does she have? Okay, same as. I like how easy items are accessible too, I like that. Such a different pace from Resident Evil. Enemies, like this is interesting. Some others have a hard shell that protects their weak points. If you come across an other like this, you'll have to break its shell to reveal its weak spot in order to defeat it. Attacking their weak spots will greatly reduce their crush gauge. Good to know. 
Oh, by borrowing, by borrowing the duplication power, you can duplicate objects used for psychokinesis. While active, enemy shells are easier to break and allows you to attack with multiple objects. Wow, extremely effective when you want to finish off multiple enemies at the same time. Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your role with Kyoka. Oh wow, so she's actually fighting with me, as opposed to like with Seto. It's on it. you have to use uh, he my wasn't really with me. Use the attack at the enemy's outer shell. You might be able to break it. <laughs> The shell is broken. Attack now. No, no. Oh. <laughs> oh, <it's okay. laughs> oh, what happened? Oh, so no one revived me that time. No one could have revived me, I guess. Where are they going to start me from? Because I don't know if the game auto saves. Dang, it just fell on me. It was like, nope. I guess we're back here. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. You should check it out. Oh, well, thank Are you. you. Shouldn't be. I'm off. Kagura. Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Kasane, normal human speed. Got it. Can't keep up with that other. Use FAS. <laughs> Oh, holy, that didn't work. It's up to you. Kagero's invisibility would be useful. Let's do this! Yeah, help me out. Oh, nice! Useless, check me. Whoa, we got good chemistry. We might be a pretty good team. <laughs> The duplication power doesn't really help me if I didn't use it right, or... You have to use my duplication. Yeah, we'll get that in Texas. Damage to outer shell confirmed. Break it! Oh, this is how I got messed up last time. Oh, did I miss me? I don't even know. She has like her party has different abilities. I wonder if they go back and forth. So like based on who you're with uh, in the story, then you kind of have a different uh, kind of ability grid. I like that. That's kind of cool. I can imagine that's different when you're when you have a different party and you kind of have to adjust. 
I go wonder if instead if you had Luca here, would you be able to use teleport to catch up with those flying enemies that go really fast, or would you kind of would you need to have um, a rock? Ikikawa is at a midpoint between Suo and Seiron, and was under development for a residential area. Construction was cancelled, but there's still heavy machinery all over. Seems the like bridge it. that runs over the river is still used as a trade route, too. But nobody lives here? This time we're going down. Let's go! Arashi, that's what I said, Arashi. What is that? Thanks. Using the shield. You help me out. Let's use our she's hyper velocity. Oh, by borrowing invincibility power and vanishing the go undetected by enemies, you can sneak to the enemy's weak point attack. Attack square, X square, special attack triangle, and PK attacks when the enemy does not detect you are always critical hits that apply massive physical and crush damage. You can execute a powerful backstab attack when dealing enormous crush damage by holding a triangle while invisible, invisible and releasing it once it's fully charged. Ooh! Additional effects will be added as you strengthen your bond with Kagero. Interesting. Okay, we'll use that in a little bit. Kasane, use invisibility with SAX. Activating Brain Drive comes with additional effects, such as increased attack speed. Yep, we've already seen this. Okay. Oh, uh, no. Oh, that was just the thing in the back. Okay, cool. I can hear your water attack. Are you okay? Being wet makes it hard to move. I'm rooting for you. I'm so confused. Oh, there we go. Seems to be the spot. Help me, Kagura. There we go. Nice. The enemy doesn't see us. You'll be shocked if you get attacked with electricity when you're wet. Be careful. Like, why did that? I don't understand why that wasn't. It's hard to move when you're wet. This is pretty good. I'm taking this. Make contact, you can get that. Oh, yeah. I'll pull you out. Nice. Yeah, okay, so that's kind of okay. So the invisibility ones, like, it's not just you don't just get to stay invisible, at least from what just happened. It seems like once I started attacking, I kind of lost it. Time for stealth. You came from Kodama Platoon, right, Sheena? Did you have a big problem with her? She acts like everything's fine, but I have no idea what she's really thinking. Also, she was hard on me for some reason. Oh, gosh, okay. That's why I was having issues in the past. You have to do both. My bad. 
I thought it was like a choice. You can go left or you can go right, but I think it's both. You just have to go both. Okay, okay, okay. I'm learning. Give it to me, Arashi. They already, oh, I thought they already went after the other enemies. It was like. Help me, Kagura. She has electrokinesis. Nice. Enemy is done. Too slow. Ouch. I do have some other kind of types of games I do want to play. I, I, I enjoy doing the horror because like I feel that's something that's easy to talk about because there's like just so much going on. But uh, there's definitely some other games I would like to play. So I'm gonna circle around this again. How do I get into this? Definitely want to hear the soundtrack of this game too. Kasane, I think my hyper velocity will be effective. In getting out of this? I don't know. Here it is. Did not have to circle that twice. My apologies. Wow, Team 
Kasani is first to the goal. There's felt shorter. Maybe because I was reading through the tutorial. So yeah, would have been first too. Boy, if you don't get it together. Good one. You picked up on the other before I did. Wait a minute. This one's a major other. Major? Gemma? A major other has appeared at the objective. Major others are others that killed OSF members in the past. Yes. Here it comes. I'll intercept. We'll be there in a few minutes. Just hold on. Contact with a major other. Don't overdo it, Kasane. She then follow her lead. She's probably not happy about that. <laughs> Send it across. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> now we're talking. Hope you're ready to see how strong I am. Quit barking then. It's time to show me some bite. <laughs> She's like, girl. This is the other that killed an OSF soldier. It's too dangerous to rush in blind. Use your head. For example, there's material hanging from the ceiling. You can use that. He killed it in this one. Oh, that's interesting. <sighs> what the hell do you think you're doing? I can protect myself, thank you very much. <laughs> Victory! The Scarlet Guardians have won! <laughs> A 
the press. The hero of this fight is, of course, Second Lieutenant Kasane Randall, who took down a major other on her first assignment. Congratulations, Lieutenant <laughs> Randall. Let's hear what she She's has so to unbothered. say. How do you feel? <sighs> you must be tired. Your first victory on your first deployment. Isn't that satisfying? Yeah, wonderful. She this is just for demo orders. purposes. Ask him about it. Oh, that was nice of her. What? You want? So I mean, you want the attention? Late. That was a good fight. Oh dear. Poor Sheedan. <laughs> this is Arashi. Sorry, looks like you caught the crow's attention. Arashi, you're right. They got Sheedan. We'll take them. That's not. So is Arashi just a digital ally? Kodama gets depressed if there are no crows around. Captain Arashi Spring. We're about to do a full sweep for others. Looking forward to seeing all you reporters there. Oh, they're finally gone. Let's go back to Suo, everyone. Copy that. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna watch this again. Um, but wow, I really enjoyed that. That was a lot of fun. Um, so that was the Scarlet Nexus demo. Um, I really enjoyed it. It's a really, really fun kind of hack and slash. I like that you have different allies with different abilities, and you kind of can use them at will and based on the situation you find themself yourselves in, yourself in, you can kind of uh, utilize different abilities to kind of suit your needs. So I actually really, really enjoyed this. Um, I do wonder, again, and, and again, my apologies if I probably should have looked at this in advance, but I wonder if just the demo is really just a, um, like a placeholder story, just so you kind of get to know a little bit about the characters where you don't really get too much information, or it is going to be like this where they have similar stories, it seems, but they're on different paths. Um, and they're different individuals, but I really enjoyed both. I will admit I liked Yuito's gameplay a little bit more. Um, I liked running up and slashing and moving back. Um, with her, I found it a little more difficult um, because she is ranged, so you kind of have to get in, get out. Um, but I really enjoyed both of them, and I enjoyed the abilities of the allies that they were with individually. I did find his were a little more useful, maybe based on the environment we were in with hers. Found it a little bit harder um, to utilize, for example, the invisibility. Like, I didn't really understand that. Like, you're invisible once you attack, them, I guess because they realize where you are then, so you lose the invisibility. But I found that one you lose pretty quickly, and the, um, the duplication one uh, kind of was using it, but I wasn't... I find my psychokinesis just went down so quickly so I could use it once or maybe twice and then I kind of couldn't throw anything else uh, to kind of benefit from that. So hers, I'm, I feel like hers, I don't know if hers, hers is going to be a little bit of a harder story or a harder gameplay um, kind of uh, character to use, but um, interested to see how both of them will continue and, and how this will play out with the game, with the story, when Scarlet Nexus actually drops. I, I really think I'm going to get it now. I actually really enjoyed this and I, I like where it's going. So I'm really glad they put out this demo so we can all play it today. But I hope you enjoyed that. Again, uh, make sure you if you're watching on Twitch, make sure you follow me. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what games you want to see. What projects you want to see me kind of play out on this. Um, if there are any demos that are coming out, please keep me in the loop. I'm, I'm always checking, but if you see something you're like, hey, with, I'd love to see you play this, or what are your thoughts on this game? I'm um, definitely open to discussing that, playing through those games, and trying different things. So make sure you let me know, and I hope you all have a great weekend. Tomorrow we are back with our Saturday. I'm, I'm so not looking forward to tomorrow day. We're playing through Resident Evil, and I am a little bit scared, a little bit nervous, but we're going to do our best, okay? We're, we're in a new manner with some new stuff. We're just going to figure it out. But have a great night, and I will see you all tomorrow.